State, you look back on the film, it's kind of the same teams. What do you do you see the changes you guys need to make or, or just what went very well? We played harder. We didn't play really hard that game. Uh, we got out-rebounded or out-hustled. Um, we just didn't play our A game. We didn't play together as a team, um, especially on the rebounds. We did a terrible job on the rebounding. So I think that's one thing that we see that we need to improve. And since it was just like a couple weeks ago, then we, we already know what we need to get done. Does this team compare to the way you're playing then till, till now? Uh, our team? Yeah, yeah we're, we're playing a lot better as a team and um, I think understanding how our team could be when we play good and um, play together. So I think that our, our growth, you know, I mean, we're later in the season now, so we're trying to understand things better and understand each other a lot better. So I think that our team just is growing together. Peyton Dunn, he's obviously the one guy back from last year, especially these last couple weeks. It seems like he's playing almost every minute and Coach talked about his leadership. What, What's he done these last couple of weeks kind of get you guys kind of all coming together? Kind of just showing us how Oregon basketball does. You know what I mean? He's one of the vets here just from uh, Oregon's uh, perspective. But uh, he's just showing us how Coach likes things and showing us what they did last year. Obviously, he went to the Final Four last year, so he knows what they need to do to accomplish things. So uh, he has just been telling us what we needed to do and showing us, too, not just, not just uh, talking but actually doing what. He says, playing harder. Yeah, harder. yeah, yeah, all that. I think it was after the last Oregon State game, Coach Altman talked about kind of getting after you guys a little more, and you watch him during the games. He's pretty animated on the, on the sideline. Have you noticed that within the last couple of weeks? Yeah, well, when I first got here, I never knew he was like that, honestly. I didn't, I didn't really watch as many games as I thought I did, but uh, I didn't know how, how animated he would be on the sideline. But, uh, yeah, for sure, he gets more into it. and. He's always been into it, but now he's just, you know, I mean, more telling us like after every play or something like that. And if we make a mistake, that's pretty obvious. Then he tries to point it out immediately. But um, he's always usually pretty animated and pretty vocal about things. So and he's so mild mannered. You yeah, yeah, wouldn't know where that comes from. I, I, I didn't know that, that he was like that at all. So is there some way that you know that he's upset? Is something he says or you can see it in his face or like if you do something, you can kind of tell he is, but he's kind of holding something back or. Or stuff like that is kind of, it's kind of, he kind of makes it obvious. So, so yeah.